Okay, so we're working through this design process, and the, the rudimentary challenge here is to measure the pulmonary function of a patient, uh, where the motivation for that is if you give a drug intervention, for example, then we want to see if the patient's pulmonary function has improved. To do that, we need to be able to quantify uh, the pulmonary function of this patient. So you've set up the, uh, the initial design here. You have a pneumotachometer, which allows you to measure the uh, flow out of the lungs of this patient. And you have the uh, other equipment here that allows you to process this. Uh, and with some luck, you will reach a design that gives you an accurate quantification. So now that we have the initial setup for your design, uh, we need to take some preliminary data to determine whether the system actually functions correctly. And then we need to quantify uh, with a calibration system whether you can accurately determine the pulmonary function of your uh, setup. So why don't we take some pulmonary data? Okay, and we see from the data on the screen that you can quantify the uh, air flowing in and out of your lungs. Uh, and now we have to step back and we have to do a calibration to make sure that this is an accurate uh, measure of your pulmonary function.